we did an application through the European Union uh, project uh, uh, Lives in Dignity. Um, we also um, had our team working on this project, basically a worldwide project for which only two countries uh, managed to, to get into, to get uh, approval for this project. Um, basically, this is a project to build resilience uh, in the communities of the Western region, especially those along the, the rivers of the, uh, the Belize River, which are severely affected every time that we have a catastrophe or some type of uh, climate change event, whether it is a flooding, fire, and in this case, we are addressing the villages of Santa Familia, Billy White, uh, Dokron 1, Dokron 2, Dokron 3, and Los Tambos. Um, the project also entails the construction of drainage, especially for the village of uh, Billy White and Los Tambos, which are two of the more affected areas when it comes to flooding. Comes to flooding. Um, we will be constructing a polyclinic in uh, Dokron 1 that will serve uh, as a centralized area for the other Dokron areas and Los Tambos. And we'll be refurbishing the clinic in Santa Familia, Billy White, and also building um, a community center slash uh, uh, hurricane shelter for uh, two other communities. So basically what we're trying to do is to assist these uh, communities who are largely migrants and to start looking at seriously how to avoid the displacement of uh, the people living in these communities because people move when they see that they are affected and when it becomes continuous and they do not get the, the, the assistance. So for years we have been crying out that we don't have and lack in some cases basic social services like water, um, education, uh, transportation and so with this project, we believe that uh, when it is completed, these uh, communities will be upgraded and they will be able to avoid the type of displacement that has occurred in the past.